Hey, what's going on, y'all? Back in the building, man. Hey, um, hope everybody having a, a sensational, blessed day today. Um, by the time I drop this video, it's gonna be the Sabbath, so, um, hope everybody have a, having a good Sabbath. Um, but yo, I, I seen, okay, I seen a, 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 a couple YouTubers that's in the truth, um, put they, they input out on Kai Connect and and this little I guess it's a like a, a prison series or they are they, they're in prison bro they're they're in a block <laughs> in a in a prison bro they they're definitely in a um in a pod right and I, I wanted to get my input out on it too bro can I get my input out on it as well um Okay. This is that now see this is this is crazy bro. This is crazy. Like they put it right in our faces, bro. They put it right in our faces, bro. Um I seen this video, a video came out with Kai Kai Kinect. He was walking <coughs> and um he literally said he's about to sign a deal. He well, literally you said know what I'm going for, you know. He said this. I wanna sign a deal. <laughs> sell my soul sell, sell my soul. soul right sell. out of his mouth he said he's about to sell his soul and um bro what man bro what's ironic to me is that like the way rap music is going right now bro they, bro rap music ain't doing nothing right now bro everybody talking about the same thing everybody sound the same everybody rapping about killing that's all they rap about now is killing guns that's all they rap about. They they not talk about nothing, bro. You know what I'm saying? Even even the rappers that's in the industry that talk about other things, like other than killing and stuff, the record labels not even letting them put out anything right now. Nothing, bro. The record labels are not pushing them at all. They they got them on hold. They got them on ice right now. Kendrick Lamar, um, J Cole, Connor. They let him come out with stuff every once in a while. But like, what about all these other rappers, bro? Like, I can't think of them, think of them right now because, like, but like, bro, like, Esau, these Jewish, you know, should I even say that, bro? They might mess around and and, uh, and ban this video. It might not even come out just because I say that word. The is people. I say that the is people. The people that's not even real. They not the real thing. Like, they see what's going on, right? <clears throat> um, they they see that we are we already really done squeezed everything we could get out of out of the the male uh, the black male rap music. We done we all we dang there, you know we squeezed everything out of that. Um, Everybody saying they sound the same. Everybody, everybody just up. They over that. A lot of people are over that stuff now, bro. Um, I ain't gonna, but um, there's still people that listen to it. But like, bro, it's dying down, bro. This stuff is dying now. This stuff, bro. They have been pushing that agenda on on black males since the '80s. Since the '80s, bro. Um, one one of the members from Bone Thugs and Harmony, he actually came out and did an interview talking about. The, the, the meeting that they had they had a meeting with these record labels and they told them exactly what the agenda was to push nothing but violence, drugs all, guns, all types of stuff like that, right? This is this is documented, bro. This, bro y'all can look this up, y'all. said so it's on YouTube um, I think it was Crazy Bone, bro one of the bones, bro. Just type it in just type it in, bro. Right, look on, right on YouTube. You can see it. He's talking about the whole thing now, it's going on for a while now, bro over 30 years and it, it's, it's starting to die down and um what's popping right now bro is these content creators bro these content creators they're going crazy bro like these content creators um you got people like the uh, the dude what's his name i am speed this dude is it's completely demonic bro I did research on him already. I was like, I've been looking at his videos and stuff like that. Like, and so even even in some of his videos, you, know, you can you can literally tell he's possessed by.
Eli Demon, like, literally, bro, like, y'all look him up, bro. Um, I'm thinking his name is I Am it's I Am Speed, he's a, um, a YouTube content creator, and, um, bro, these people have, like, like, hundreds of millions of followers, bro, subscribers, and Esau sees this, bro, like, any anytime he sees where children are being influenced, bro, they gon' they yo, you bet you, you think they not gonna, you know what I'm saying, shoot their shot, bro? You think they're not gonna put their hand in that? Of course they're gonna put their hand in it. Of course they is. Every single time. Every single time. Um they Esau sees that these content creators are, are blowing up, bro. Like, these kids are really looking up to them now. They're looking up to these content creators, bro. Duke, um, people like Duke Dennis, um, his whole group. Um, Ty Connect, he, he actually comes out of that same group as um, Duke Dennis. They are a whole little group called Amp. The name of that group is called Amp. Um, that's where Ty Connect came from. He came from out of, out of that group. He's a content creator as well. Um, um, a few months ago, right? Kai Connect got into a little bit of trouble out of New York. That's where he's from. He's from New York. Um, I think it's from the Bronx. I think. <coughs> I think that's where he's from. One of those bros. He's from New York. But yo, he had a a free shoe giveaway, or something like that, out there in New York. And bro, a lot of y'all not, bro. In the streets of New York, wherever they was at out there, it looked like it was thousands of them out there. Fans. These are fans, bro. What y'all said? Post a video? Alright, I'm gonna post it. This is the video of all the people, bro, that was that was there just because of Cock Connect, right? And um after that, um they said that he incited a riot, you know, and um, I guess he got locked up for maybe like a day or something like that. I don't know if he's still awaiting trial or whatever, but even if he is awaiting trial, they're dismissing that, bro, because he signed the oath. He already signed the oath. He signed the soul already, you know what I'm saying? So that's, that, bro, that's a small, that's small price stuff, bro. They, they not, they're not worried about that, bro. Um, Kakanet has a, he has a, he has a role in this agenda now. He has a role to, to keep the young youth asleep. Um, bro, after that, Esau saw that. He was, Esau was like, wow, the people at the round took this, like, they like, like, wow, bro, you know what I'm saying? Like, look at all the influence this dude got. Like, af after he got locked up and stuff like that, they was like, but hold on. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They, they was like, we can't keep, we can't keep him in, in, in jail. Look at the influence that he has. We can't keep him in jail. We can use him. They seen that. And he was already big then, but now he's going to get even bigger. Um, especially that Especially that he took the oath and, and signed away his life. This dude that signed away his life. And he knows it. That's the thing about it. He knows it. And he knows what he's doing, bro. These these people, they're, they're in, in this prison, bro. This is a real prison, too. Like, this ain't no fake. This is a real prison that they're, that they're in, bro. And as you can see, like, they, they're, glorif they're glorifying being in prison, bro. They glorifying it. They got all types of people in there. They got, bro, they got Emily Chopper in the building. They got this, this dang old demonic female. I, I can't even call her a woman. This demonic female, Krishan Rock in the building. In, in, in the prison. It's a, just a whole bunch of, you know, um, a whole bunch of young people that's influencing the youth. You know, uh, who else they had? Drewski. Now, Drewski is funny, bro. I, I can't even lie, bro. Like, he's a funny person, bro, but He's also with the agenda as well, man. Unfortunately, he's with the agenda. <clears throat> um, who else? It's just a lot, a lot of people, bro. That's that's 
that's in the that's in the industry that's that's influencing the youth. That's um in this little seven days, seven days in this little prison thing that they doing. And it they making it seem like it's fun, you know what I'm saying? They making it seem like it's fun. Um alluring. Uh, like the Bible says, Satan comes as an angel of light. You know what I'm saying? Like even with that, like young kids looking at this like Oh man, y'all ain't nothing, bro. Look what they doing. They making it seem like it's going crazy and it is it's fun. You know, um, most kids haven't seen or you know what I'm saying they don't know how 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 prison really is, how jail really is in there, bro. It's not like that. Don't worry about what they got going on, bro. This is just this is an agenda that they're pushing. And I'm and I'm gonna make sure kids see this video, man. Kids gotta see this video, bro. Prison not where y'all want to be. Are y'all nuts? Like really? Yeah, it look like it's fun and games, but y'all have y'all have to understand we're not dealing with flesh and blood. We're dealing with uh, spiritual. This is all spiritual. We're dealing with um, spiritual wickedness and uh, principalities. Um, this is not what we see on the surface. This is not what we see on the surface. Everything has an agenda with these people. Everything. Just because y'all see nothing but black people in, 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 in this um, little prison video thing, what they got going on, y'all got to understand, it's people behind this. <clears throat> understand it, it's people behind this. Coconut and all them, like, I don't, I don't even, I don't even feel like they was the ones that even brought up the idea, you know what I'm saying? These white people, they probably the ones that sat at the table and they was like, we should do this. This is what we should, we should do. We should do this. Um, you gotta understand, bro. Majority of the of the prisons are filled with black people, bro. Like they they know that they know that when, once they get to you, they gonna see this, bro. They gonna they gonna see this content that's gonna be coming out, and they gonna look past that. They gonna look past. how bad jail is like they gonna really think jail is really a joke subconsciously though this is subconsciously they're gonna think that it's a joke you know what i'm saying so that's gonna continue to have them living lawlessly because this is the agenda that they pushing out they're not pushing it out like as in like bro this is a terrible place to be no bro they they in the building <laughs> Cockney and all them, bro, they in the building like, yeah, this is, what, this is what's going on. This is what's going on, bro. Um, these, all these, all the people that you seen in that video, they all sold these souls, bro. Then you got Chris Sean rocking there, reading the Bible. Like, come on, bro. Bro, you in here reading the Bible in this junk, man? She in there reading the Bible, bro. This is one of the most wicked people in the in the entertainment industry right now. Literally, bro. This girl has a tattoo of devil horns on her leg, bro. Can't make this up. Is she in there just because she got a dad that's a, a pastor? Christian Rock, you're not saved, bro. You're not gonna be saved. You're gonna you're gonna go straight to Lake of Fire right along with those white people that's that's making y'all do this. You're going along right along with them, Cockinet. All of y'all are going to the Lake of Fire if y'all don't repent. Y'all leading the sheep to the slaughter, bro. You know what I'm saying? You got Christian Rock, like she was just on this um TV show. Whatever the fuck I want to do. Um, have, she Jesus was pregnant to her. She, I don't she know. Get she, was, too? she was beating up. You want to get slapped too? Do you know that too? Yeah, she had somebody else beat up both people because. Right, go slap her. She's trying faith, to go viral. Of her faith in y'all. Her, 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 her faith in God. What the hell? Yeah. 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 And got her ass with for Christ. <laughs> Do you hear me? And she was like, Jesus loves you. That's what Christian Rock did, bro. The, bro, the demons were so um was so um irritated by her for even saying that. That's what Christian Rock did, bro. Christian Rock after after uh Will Vicky already got beat up one time, she told the girl to go beat her up again just because of saying that, bro. And these are the people that 
y'all are following. Like you got grown women following after people like Chris Sean Rock. They want to be like her. Like, y'all nuts, bro. Y'all must be nuts. Y'all following. Y'all, bro. Y'all are following. Following demonic Carlos. Very demonic, bro. These people are demonic, bro. But um. I just wanted to go ahead and put that video out. I don't want this video to be too long, guys. I just wanted y'all to get my um, opinion on this. Um, <clears throat> all the people that you see in this um, in this prison video, this thing, whatever that they got going, all these people are going to get bigger and bigger and bigger because they they are conforming to Satan's agenda. They conform to it. And, um, they have no control of themselves anymore. They have to do this thing. They have to. Kakanet is under a contract. He has to do this. And guess what? If he doesn't conform to their to the agenda, they're either going to kill him or shame him. Something's going to happen with him if he doesn't conform. But he wanted the money. Um, the love of money is the root of all evil. It's not the surface, y'all. It's not the surface. This life is not chronic. Anyways, y'all. Love y'all. Talk to y'all later.